Well, howdy there, pluckers. I have a sore finger again with you. Thanks very much for joining me for another guitar lesson. This is uh, another classic from Rod Stewart called Ooh La La. Okay, and uh, I have put a link in the description box underneath the video to the recording by Rod Stewart that I'm basing this lesson on. And to play that along with him, um, I'm in standard tuning, but I've got a capo on the first fret. Okay. So this brings it here into the key of E flat, but we'll be playing it with D shapes, okay, that sort of thing, e, D, E minor and G, okay. So, um, the other thing to note is the intro on this number, which is quite distinctive. Uh, that's played on a 12 string, and with another guitar, a 6 string underneath picking, picking guitar notes out of the chords, okay? So rather than just play the boring, or not doing it at all, I've tried to combine the two together with a bit of chord work and the lead line. So uh, that makes it a bit more interesting with one guitar. Uh, then I'm going to do the, um, so I'm going to do the intro, the first verse and the first chorus, and then you've got basically 99% of what you need to play this number, because basically it's just verses and choruses. Uh, the only thing that I will show you other than that is after the second chorus there is a very short chordy based uh, lead, well not lead but uh, instrumental rhythmy bit which is like a, an instrumental in a way. It's quite easy to miss it but I'll show it to you anyway okay so uh, we'll come to that after I've broken down the main song. Okay so here we go. <clears throat> The only other thing that uh, is different, I think, is uh, after the second chorus, so he does another verse and another chorus, there's a, it comes out of the second chorus where he goes, four times okay and then it goes back into the da 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 Right, so let's get to it. Right, the introduction. Right, all I'm doing is placing, basically I'm playing the, that. Right. So. Okay, so it's, so it's second fret, third string, third string open, so, I'm, whilst I'm playing the D. Fourth fret into 
three, four, yeah, fourth fret on the fourth string with pinky, second fret on fourth fret, okay? So second string, second fret, third string, open third string, trying to pick them out. Fourth fret, fourth string, second fret, fourth string. Open fourth string, second fret, fourth string, fourth fret, fourth string. So, okay, and then you play open third, fourth fret, fourth string, third, second fret, fourth string, open fourth string, o hammer from open fifth to second fret fifth. To the open fourth, okay. So it's like hit the note, part, keep those two fingers planted, okay, of the D chord, okay. So it's the the um, I think it's a, a pipe and it's a sort of penny whistle sort of thing and right and we're playing a four finger E minor seventh normal D and we put a pinky on the third fret of the first string so you've now got the two second and third first strings on the third fret okay like that and now you play add the E minor shape. So first finger is going on the second fret of the fifth, and my first second finger is going on the second fret of the fourth. So you've got four fingers. Play all six strings, that's all right. Okay, so. Okay. Da, 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 so then it goes to a G, keeping those fingers where they are planted on the first and second strings on the third fret, go to a G. So G. Four finger G. E minor. G. Then so it does that twice. Okay. So from the beginning. Okay. Those two chords. Right now to the D. Wish. E minor seven for the four fingers. Now G. When I was younger. D with the four fingers. Seven with four fingers, G with four fingers, and then back to the penny whistle bit. E G C E minor sevens G into the second verse. The such a pretty short. Just those two chords, the D and E minor seven. Exactly the same way as the first verse and the first chorus, okay? And when it comes out of the first second chorus, where it goes, I, 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 
So D chord, strum, single note, third on the second, opens first, then second on the first. G, four, four finger G, yeah. lower the bass note to the second fret, open. Repeat. Got that? So down, lower the bass note, down, lower the bass note to open E, down, D. Little riff. Third note on the second string, open first, second on the first, okay? that four times. Okay. Well there you have it, that's, that's 100% of the song. <laughs> okay, thank you very much for watching this thing. I hope that uh, helps a few people out with that number. Uh, it's quite a pleasant little ditty that. And get a nice sing along with that one. Thanks very much for watching this in, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.